Once upon a time, in a village by the sea, there was a little boy named Elvis. Elvis was a curious boy who loved to explore. He wasn't like the other children who played in the fields. Instead, he liked to wander near the cliffs, where the sea met the land. One sunny day, as Elvis walked along the shore, he spotted something strange. It was a hidden cave. The cave was covered in vines and rocks, but Elvis wasn't scared. He was excited. He wanted to know what was inside. Carefully, Elvis crawled through the cave's entrance. Inside, he saw sparkling crystals that shone like stars in the night sky. They made the cave look magical. Elvis felt like he was in a fairy tale. He kept walking, following the soft light of the crystals. Soon, he reached a big room filled with even more shiny crystals. In the middle of the room, there was a special crystal ball. It was bigger than any Elvis had ever seen. As Elvis got closer to the crystal ball, he heard a voice. Hello, young traveler, the voice said. It was kind and friendly. I am the guardian of this cave. My name is Sparkle. What is yours? I'm Elvis, Elvis replied, feeling a little nervous but excited too. Sparkle smiled. Elvis, you have been chosen for a special adventure. Are you ready? Elvis nodded eagerly. He wanted to know what the adventure was. Sparkle explained that long ago, the cave was made to protect something very important called the Star Stone. The Star Stone kept the world in balance between light and darkness. But now, the darkness wanted to take the Star Stone. If it did, the world would be sad and gloomy forever. Only someone with a kind heart could save it. Elvis knew he had a kind heart. He wanted to help. Sparkle gave Elvis the Star Stone and told him he had to go on a journey. He had to be brave and face challenges to save the world. Elvis felt a little scared, but he knew he had to be brave. He held the Star Stone tight and set off on his adventure. Along the way, Elvis met friendly creatures who helped him. He climbed tall mountains, crossed rushing rivers, and explored dark caves. Sometimes he felt afraid, but he remembered Sparkle's words. You are brave, Elvis! You can do it! Finally, after many days of traveling, Elvis reached the place where the darkness lived. It was a scary place, but Elvis didn't give up. He used the Star Stone's magic to shine bright light, chasing away the darkness. The darkness was gone, and the world was happy again. Flowers bloomed, birds sang, and everyone cheered for Elvis. With a smile on his face, Elvis returned home. He was a hero! And even though his adventure was over, he knew he would always remember the magic of the shiny cave and the friends he made along the way.